as well because there's a little bit of rain Alex which we yes, need. Yes rejoice for gardens and growers I think Victoria <laughs> thank you hello good afternoon to you yes but love it or loathe it at long last some welcome rain but not such uh, a great day for us if you were hoping for a day out some bathing on the beach this has been the earlier radar then we've seen some torrential downpours the rain formed a band in more central parts of Cornwall and Devon this morning and we're now starting to see a more organized of persistent rain spreading in from the west so with the rain falling on really dry ground out there take care this afternoon the rain may well cause some flooding and some disruption as well so if it is causing you problems your BBC local radio station will keep you up to date and here is that rain heavy and persistent for a time continuing to spread spread steadily further eastwards. Parts of Somerset to East Devon and Dorset may well hang on to that rain for longest I think this afternoon whereas for Cornwall and western parts of Devon perhaps easing for a time but only to be followed by some sharp showers. A lot of cloud out there this afternoon and feeling really quite cool I think especially if you do keep that heavy rain. 18 degrees our high a bit below average for this time in early July. As this evening and overnight wears on then that rain band gradually eases away way to the east followed on by scattered showers but also some clearer spells to a coolish night temperatures down to between 9 to 13 degrees for tomorrow the main headline is it's drier and it's brighter there'll still be a scattering of showers dotted around but certainly not the heavy rain that we'll see this afternoon some sunny spells in between and with more sunshine feeling a bit better and warmer with 21 celsius the likely high that rain arriving for the channel lines this evening and overnight before clearing away later and then for the outlook, it's generally drier and a bit warmer with more sunshine later this week. Take care, Victoria.